rule that all homeowners must know about that can keep the banks from taking your house. Fox News legal analyst Bob Massey is here with me to explain. Good morning, Good morning to you, Bob. Richard. All right, so this is, this is so complicated, but I want to try and break it down because it it's so important. And you say yeah. it all deals with the MERS, M-E-R-S, the curse of the MERS. Yes. What the heck is that? All right, so our viewers understand, it's just called, MERS was put into effect about 10 years ago, actually by the lenders and Freddie and Fannie. And what it was, there's so many mortgages, millions that were chopped up. There was this electronic registration system that was used to actually register your mortgage. So when you went to buy a home, depending upon who your lender was, and depending upon what they did with the mortgage, this was a system electronically to record your mortgage because that's how complicated it was. So it is a system of registration that was in effect over 10 years ago. Okay, so now how can that come into play for some 62 million homeowners who yeah. may face foreclosure? This is catching a lot of ground in the courts. So any of our viewers who has received a foreclosure notice from MERS, M-E-R-S, what the courts are saying is this. They say, wait a second. You are you are nothing more but a portal or a way to record your documents for the lenders. And that you literally, in the courts, Gretchen, we have a thing called standing. Somebody has to have a legal basis to foreclose. Some of the courts in this country, in California, Nebraska, Nevada, Florida, have said, wait a second. Until you could show that you actually are a legitimate interest holder in that property, that you can cannot foreclose. You don't have the right to do it because you don't hold the original note in your hand. Therefore, you're nothing more than a fiction that was created by the lenders and the courts are basically restraining the foreclosures based on the MERS theory. So any of our viewers out there who have received this, I I've been involved in a lot of this litigation. They need to look and have it studied by a lawyer for purpose of seeing if they can stop the foreclosure.